Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Sophie. It's December, which is crazy, but on the first of every single month, or the second, I will typically do a little reset routine, which is really just some admin. So I thought I would talk to you guys and take you through everything that I do at the beginning of every single month. This is a non-negotiable for me. I've been doing this since I pursued you know, social media, being self-employed, being a business owner, and I could not imagine not doing this monthly little routine. So I'll take you guys through that in a second. I just finished my morning routine. I had some water, did some ice rolling, did some journaling. If you guys are new here, my journal is the Conscious Wellness Club, which is my small business. It's a self-guided wellness journal based around the eight dimensions of wellness, and it's available on Amazon. I have it linked down below in the description of every single video on my channel i quite literally went through every single video and i updated the link i was going to do a little get ready with me in this video put some makeup on and do my hair but i actually don't think i'm going to do that in this video i think i'd rather just jump right into it film some content maybe film another video getting ready doing my hair and then film some more content so we're just gonna get right into today's video which by the way is sponsored by david archie they sent me these fleece pajamas which are a great gift idea for men that i had to share with you guys These are going to be linked down below in the video description for you along with the discount code. I'm also probably going to share a link in my community section of my YouTube channel in case you're interested in checking them out. These are 100% premium polyester fleece. They're super soft and polyester is really great for heat retention, especially in the cold winters. I'm not gonna lie, I'm always stealing my man's pajamas and sweatshirts and sweatpants. So whenever I buy him a gift like this, it's kind of like I'm actually buying it for myself since I'm going to be wearing it anyway. This fleece sweater is so soft, I can already tell it's going to be so comfy and I will definitely be wearing this all winter long so again if you're looking for a gift idea for your man for yourself this is a great idea so do check out the link down below in the video description and thank you to david archie for sponsoring this video so for my monthly reset routine i'll typically spend a whole day resetting as i do on like a sunday reset where i quite literally spend either half a day or even a full day just resetting my monthly reset routine is really just some admin so every single month i'll reflect on the past month what worked what didn't work what my goals were what progress i made towards those goals my income and my social media growth and i do have two separate spreadsheets where i track both my income and my social media growth now i have very smart goals as you may know my main goal right now is to get my us visa and leave canada which really comes down to consistency and strategy i have very smart goals i think that having smart goals is so important and smart is an acronym it stands for specific measurable attainable realistic and time-bound goals so my goals right now are really just related to my income and my finances as i'm saving towards my goals which again is really just a matter of consistency and strategy right now i organize my life in both notion and google calendar so i'm going to actually grab my phone so i can run you guys through all the different pages i have in my notion all right i'm back with my phone and so in my notion i have a couple different pages so one is a full breakdown of my goals for 2023 and 2024 i quite literally have a checklist and so i have a checklist of all of my goals and then lower i have them all broken down on a monthly basis every single month i can be making progress and hitting specific milestones i also have some notes as well and again because my goals are very smart very specific measurable attainable realistic and time bound it's really easy for me to write them out and have a very clear timeline in mind then i have a daily check-in 
And in my daily check-in, I have my goals for the month at the very, very top, just as like a reminder that I can see every single day. Then I have my to-do list for the day. I also have a little note section where I have the things that must get done this month, like partnerships. And then if I keep scrolling, I actually have a few mood boards on how I want my Instagram to look during that month. Um, some photos for inspiration. And then I also have my youtube schedule upcoming videos video ideas and then just like a huge brain dump that i'm constantly revisiting i quite literally have video ideas for in a year from now and again just based on my goals and having you know smart goals so exciting um and i really feel like obviously i can't predict the future and it's good to be excited without being you know out of touch with your current reality it's still really fun to be able to look at my goals look at the timelines and have content based around where i'm going to be in a year from now i have mentioned this before but i quite literally have my whole year of youtube content planned out and obviously i do a bit of refinement but i'm definitely someone who over analyzes and over prepares but that's just like the only way i can do it i also have a page which is just basically a big brain dump for different social medias as well as my small business and another note which is basically everything i need to know related to my future of getting my visa and an apartment so things like how much i need to have saved you know before i move i have very specific goals in mind like i want to have a full year of rent saved set aside as an emergency fund then of course i'll need to get a car i'll need insurance i need to get the visa to start with an agency all these different things so i just have tons of notes and a huge brain dump there now that specific note related to my visa and moving to the states is something i was adding to throughout the year and every time i'd have a call with my lawyer you know i'd be adding to it and creating a game plan and now i'm at a point where i don't really have to check it but i know it's there and once i start my visa application based on when i want to have the visa in hand everything's there and i can just go down that list and slowly check things off and that's just me being over prepared but again that's just what helps me personally i'm going to spend the next hour or so just looking at my notion what partnerships i have timelines content i want to get done upcoming videos and i'm going to put everything from there into my google calendar typically i'll have my entire month of content planned out of course i move things around the lighting and the weather can be very inconsistent here so some days are not great for content but I have a very flexible schedule and I think it's just good to have, you know, timelines and all these little micro goals um, built into my daily routine. So again, it's always possible to get everything done when I have it in my calendar, but pretty much everything always gets done at some point or another and it's good to have something to look at otherwise i'm just way too confused and overwhelmed so that is all for this video this is what i do every single month as like my monthly reset routine this works really well for me and in the future i'd love to be more transparent about what my goals are when they're less related to my finances since right now it's really just related to my finances my income and it's all really just a matter of consistency and strategy and that's why i have this youtube channel like i'm not doing anything groundbreaking i've said that before i'm just being consistent with a bit of strategy involved and this is how i'm working towards my goals and again you guys know what my goals are and i will definitely be very open about the process of getting my visa and moving in the coming weeks and months thank you so so much for 60,000 subscribers i'm grateful for all of you i appreciate you guys and i'll see you in the next one